recording. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you don't already know, my name is Jewel, and as you can tell by the title, in today's video, I'm going to be filming a get ready with me. So there are a few changes. Now I'm filming on a Canon G7X. Before I was filming on a Canon also, but it wasn't mine. Um, I would use my mom's camera that she uses for photography to film. I bought it myself. I thought it would be a good investment because I really want to start this YouTube thing. What better way to motivate yourself than spending? Like if you guys know how much a Canon G7X costs, then I don't even have to say it. I don't even want to say it. The number is ugly, so I'm not going to say it. But what better way to motivate you? And sorry, I keep looking up there because the viewfinder is right there, but I need to look here, which is where you guys are and where the camera is. But as you can tell, I look horrendous. I have this pimple patch on right now because there's a pimple trying to grow on my nose and my hair. I'm just letting it do whatever it wants right now. Um, I don't know. But I'm going to dinner with my best friend at 6.30. She is coming home from college for the weekend, so we're gonna go get dinner. It is currently 4.08. So I have about two hours, a little bit more than two hours to get ready. So that's pretty good. Um, and I wanted to start getting ready. Oh gosh, okay, I should never do that. Oh God. I have you guys on my bed. I am um, using this tripod that also came with the camera. I'm still trying to figure out how to use it. It's not the easiest tripod to use, but I have it on my bed leaning against um, my camera bag. So work with me. I think I have an idea of what I want to wear because the weather is super nice today. So it's currently 66 degrees today. But I really want to wear a dress because it looks really nice out. The sun is out. I think I have an idea of what I want to wear. But first, I need to do my hair. So let's go. Alright, so we're currently in my bathroom. You guys are literally sitting on my sink. I've always wanted to film more videos in my bathroom because this is where I do my hair a lot. The camera that I had was way too big and I didn't have a tripod that could fit in here because it's kind of small. But anyways, I'm the rambling. We're here and you guys can see me do my hair. So I always do my hair first when I'm getting ready. I think the hairstyle that I'm going to do. I tried this hairstyle for the first time like a few weeks ago and I fell in love. So basically you like separate the front pieces and then you put the rest up. Slip these front pieces down and tie them in the back. I'm pretty sure you get the concept. And then those curls in the back I'm just going to put into a cute bun. The bun will have the curls coming out too. I feel like it's such an easy hairstyle but it also looks like you put effort into it. I have a lot of a lot of hairstyles that I want to share with you guys so let me know if you want to see that and even if you don't let me know I'm still gonna show y'all so but yeah so let's do my hair got my water got my gel brush Alright, real quick, before I keep jamming to my music, I put the scarf on my hair to lay down the part that I slicked back. And I also did my edges just so I can get that over with and have them laid down too. So now I'm going to do this part of my hair. Alright, so... Y'all see how I just did the ponytail, now I'm going to kind of pick it up so it looks like that claw clip hair trend. I don't want to use a clip, but the clip doesn't hold my hair enough, especially right now that my curls are dry, so they're a lot bigger. So I have a hair tie. How I do it, I'm just going to bring it up like this, okay? And I'm literally just going to grab a chunk in the back of that and tie only that part. I think that looks good and you can just like play around with the curls pull them out more so it looks better yeah, i think that looks pretty good so now i'm going to take this off and we're just going to fix it up and bobby pin but yeah i just wanted to show y'all so yeah so this is my hair My hair looks, show y'all a mirror view. My hair looks, sorry my mirror is dirty. So you guys just saw me do my hair and I'm about to do my makeup. But before I do my makeup, I wanna do my eyebrows because 
um, I have some hairs growing back but I'm doing my makeup and I say it like this because I don't want y'all to think I'm about to do a full face because I really don't I usually just do mascara sometimes even not all the time but I do mascara I do blush I love blush I do my eyebrows like I use eyebrow gel lipstick lip gloss highlighter stuff like that. that's what I'm gonna show you guys me doing but first and I have this tweezer from tweezer man focus please so perfect but yeah, I have this tweezer from tweezer man and it's so cute it's like this um, black glittery thing it looks like stars so I'm about to tweeze my eyebrows and I have this mirror right here and I'm gonna take this patch off too because I think I think we're good so as I'm doing my eyebrows I just wanted to take this time to talk to you guys because I haven't posted in a minute the last time I posted was in November December um I don't know it was definitely in 2021 because it was either November or December that I posted that video. I know I filmed it in November, but I'm not too sure when it went up. So I haven't seen you guys in a minute. And to be honest, I just wasn't feeling motivated like whatsoever to film. Um, I was in school. I'm still in school, but I was in my spring semester, the first quarter of my spring semester, which got really busy my attention was mainly on school after the new year had started and after we had that break also i know a lot of y'all don't know but i did take like a gap semester so i did start my fall semester um at fit but i ended up taking a gap semester so i didn't i didn't go all the way with that fall semester and i decided to just wait until the spring semester so i waited till the spring semester to go back to school and i'm no longer at fit which is crazy to say i know a lot of people don't know that and now i'm like putting it on the internet but you know everything happens for a reason how things are going right now does feel a lot more like i am where i'm supposed to be i am in online school and that's what i did for the first quarter of the spring semester and then you know i had spring break which spring break was awesome i didn't go anywhere but just have that time to myself have that self-care and self-love and just like hang out with friends and family so refreshing and i honestly needed that especially after such a stressful spring semester so we're back in school and it's stressful again but i'm maintaining it and i'm organizing my time and then on top of that i had work and stuff so i just was not in a place to film but obviously now I'm feeling a lot more motivated. And like I told you about the camera, which was one of my main reasons to get the camera. I'm ready to be posting consistently for y'all. I don't know how many people will see this, but whoever it reaches, I'm excited for you to be on this journey with me. Um, like honestly, I am really excited to be filming again. I'm excited to have this camera. Like I have a professional filming camera, vlogging camera, whatever. And it feels so good. I'm so excited for the summer. I'll be back when I'm done doing my eyebrows because it's gonna take a minute. I just finished my eyebrows. I don't know if you could tell. I do have them brushed down right now, so let me just fix that. So yeah, so it doesn't matter right now. I'm going to use um, my, I'm gonna gel them down and I actually use this NYX eyebrow glue. It's called the brow glue. I actually love this. Um, it works really good. You don't wanna use too much of this though because um, then it can kind of leave like a white cast on your eyebrows. You just don't want to use too much, you know, like wipe the tip on the opening once you um, dump the brush in so that you could get rid of some. Oh, I think I might have used too much even though I literally wiped the tip. Okay. Just brush them up. So I don't want to let the gel sit for too long because it's going to get hard. So I'm going to take my spoolie, which I have the Morphe eyebrow brush. So I'm just going to rebrush it. This is kind of going to be my like shaping of the eyebrow. This is kind of like soap brows. Honestly, it's the same concept, except I'm using a gel and not soap. There we go. Eyebrows finished I know y'all are seeing all my bumps on my forehead um, my skin was acting up for a minute um, especially because I was not in the best place mentally and I was just very stressed like I was telling you guys so I do have a few bumps they're very um, small it's normal you know acne is normal we are not all perfect if you don't look too close you can't see it, so we're just not gonna look 
close okay also i just want to apologize the lighting is like kind of yellow and i'm not too sure how to work the settings right now i'm still figuring that out on the camera i literally just got it like a week ago not even i was kind of debating if i should do like a little wing liner because sometimes it looks really good when i do it the first try and other times it's not too good and i have to keep trying it i am going to dinner and i want to look extra cute so maybe i will do it i do use the nars um orgasm blush but yeah so i really love this color it is perfect i actually first tried this when it was my sister's i used all of her blush and i feel really bad but she bought me my own for my birthday so yes yeah, so i'm gonna use it right now i'm gonna go in the bathroom actually okay so like i was telling you guys i usually don't use anything else but those things like mascara blush highlighter sometimes if i do have a few pimples that i want to cover up i will use concealer and i use this maybelline this maybelline concealer in the shade 20 sand sable yeah there's just like a few so i'm just gonna i'm just gonna like cover them up and for highlighter i use the fenty beauty highlighter this one's my favorite as you can see this one doesn't get used it's in the um the shade girl next door that's what that one's called i use my finger for my nose and then I grab some with my brush to do on my cheeks so I find where the light hits. I feel like you can't really see much on camera. Maybe it's the lighting. I think it is the lighting. Honestly, I might just take you guys into my bathroom. It sucks over here. I want to do a lot because I have really dry skin and I want to just... Oh, I think I just inhaled some. I'll show y'all what I do with my lips. I... First, use CarMax. I moisturize my lips before I do anything. I have these two clear lip glosses that I've been using that I really, really love. This Rosehip Oil lip gloss I got from my cousin. This is really good and I love how it makes my lips look. But I did pick this up um, like a month ago. Lip oil by this brand called Black Opal and it's black owned. It's so beautiful. It looks so nice on my lips. So I think I'm going to go with this today. And it looks so yummy. That's usually what I do. I don't really add color to my lips. I think I'm going to chill for a little bit. And then I'll come back to y'all and show y'all the fit. And I'll have my mascara. And I think I'll do eyeliner. I don't know. We'll decide then. But yeah, so I'll be right back. So I just did my mascara. The lighting is not doing it justice. But I just did my eyeliner. And it came out so good. I only put the mascara on like the tip the end lashes so i'm gonna get dressed really quick because i have like 20 minutes before i have to leave so i'm gonna go do that okay i wanted to show y'all the fit so obviously you saw the hair this is what the hair is looking like this is what the face is looking like we got the mascara we got the eyeliner the lip gloss so this is my jewelry um let's get into it i have butterflies this white butterfly that i got from small business and then these i got from forever 21 so i have this big butterfly this one that says princess and then i have my gold chain that i always wear it's just those four and then i'm wearing this black dress it's literally black simple from h&m and then i put this cute little sweater on top which is from forever 21 it has like this little rip look going on and then I love the v-neck and I have this bag that I got from Depop it is a coach bag from Depop vintage coach bag I'm in love with it on my arms I have this pearl bracelet this gold bang bangle and these like a few little gold chain bracelets it's carnelian crystal bracelet to fit and then for my shoes I'm wearing my Jordans and they're pink them on right now because I'm still in my room. But yeah, that's the fit. Before I go, I just wanted to say thank you guys for getting ready with me. She's gonna be here soon and I'm like freaking out. <laughs> yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you stay till the very end, just know that I appreciate you. And regardless if you comment, subscribe, like the video, I still appreciate you for watching. So thank you. Um, and I'll see you guys in my next video.